Okay, filming back to back after filming what I read in January and February. But, um, welcome back to my channel. I'm Yoon, and this is my channel, Tokja Yoon. And today I'll be talking about my TBR for Koreathon, hosted by Books with Chloe and um, Monica Kim. And I, so I read, I watched both vid, both channels' videos. I can't remember what Books with Chloe said, but I know Mon Monica Kim's channel saying that the challenges are optional, so I don't have to do all of them, which is a relief because I like forgot. <laughs> to get um a book for one of the challenges and i'm just like i'm not let me look something up super quick so maybe more than one challenges will not be fulfilled in terms of reading because i really i was kind of sure one of the books i wanted to reread had won an award but now i'm not super sure if it was the author that won the award or like the trend or the translator that won the award so a little iffy right now but i'm still gonna reread it because i love the book and it is a current oh you know what it matches another one okay so the reading challenge tbr that i managed to pick out was a book translated from korean oh first of all i managed to get a physical copy of the group book, Winter in Sokcho, by Elisa Shua Dusapin. I don't know how to pronounce French. Dusap Dusapin. But um, Winter in Sokcho. Anyways, so this is the group book that I got. I'm actually really excited. It feels like very annotated -y book, and it's it's super pretty. Like, it's just nice to have for visual purposes and my sister actually wanted to keep it to like set it up in her room but i have winter and sokcho so that's the group book and then another reading challenge was read a book translated from korean which is lemon that i have that i absolutely love um if you have watched my other my recent wrap-up video I talk a lot about this. If you haven't, it's only 147 pages. It'll take me like an hour and a half to read it. Maybe shorter because it's a reread. I absolutely love the psychological suspense and like aspect of the characters and the events and the plot twist. <sighs> I'm very excited to reread this again. It is Lemon by Kwon Yeosun. Kwon Yeosun. Super excited to read it. <sighs> so excited um a now the next one is read a manhwa webtoon or graphic novel this one I'm also prepared for because i bought physical copies of webtoons to practice korean i have not yet done that but i might as well so this is yeah. or translated in english omniscient reader's viewpoint it has it has recently been, uh, let's get the lighting back, recently re really popular because it got translated into English. And uh, please check out the webtoon, it's super fun. The main character's name is actually where I based my channel name off of because his name is Kim Tokja, and Tokja is reader in Korean. So I'm gonna be reading volume two because I managed to finish volume one. But Chanji Jok Tokja Shijong, Omniscient Reader's Viewpoint. This is this is my choice. Excited to read it. And then a historical fiction novel. I am very excited because I thought I wouldn't be able to do this uh, this challenge because I thought the wait was longer. But the book managed to be available, so I will be reading *The Red Palace* by Jun Her. And <clears throat> I am very excited and very intrigued i'm not really sure exactly what the book is about like, i can't remember but i i think it's like a murder mystery and then somebody said the male lead is like super handsome so i'm like you got me there and an award-winning korean novel this one i don't know 
I watched Books with Chloe's TBR and I think she said Human Acts is award winning and it's also recommended by Korean Celebrity and I have been wanting to read it because I just heard it's like a really good book to read. So I also got Human Acts by Hang Gang. A floppy paper back which I'm also look look how nice and floppy it like does not break but so I got human X I know it's recommended by RM from BTS and oh it says an award-winning controversial bestseller so this also won an award it's a award-winning Korean novel human X by Hang Gang and yeah that is my TBR it's very short thankfully because um school is starting soon and thankfully the recruitathon is also like the first full week of of classes so thank you uh chloe and monica for making the recruitathon early <laughs> in march and just school season um but yeah my tbr right now is just four books or three books and one webtoon and Korean novels just tend to be pretty short, but this is it. I can't, the light is just like, not doing too well, but yeah. I'm very excited to read these books, or reread, and yeah. And then life challenges, cook a Korean meal or dish, watch a Korean film or show, and support a Korean creator. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I don't know if I'll be able to watch a Korean film or show. Watching a new show might not be good at this time of the semester. Maybe a film. I don't know. We'll have to see if there's one that... Oh, I think I might try Criminal Minds in Korea. Like Korean Criminal Minds. Or another like a crime comedy show that my parents were liking and that my sister was also surprisingly laughing her head off at so maybe that one i just have to remember what it's called and then i don't know what support korean 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 creator means oh wait a minute i think books with chloe said creator as in like booktuber or does do they mean like social media like content creator or something I honestly thought I could get by by just like showing the stickers I bought from people, but maybe that's not what they're talking about. I I have to rewatch their video again. But yeah, and then I will also because I think is the point. I will link their videos down below, um, or tag them. I'm not really sure what to do in this case, but I will. Put the links of the hosts and creators of this of this readathon in my description box below, and let me know if you guys are gonna join and if you have a TBR picked out or anything. And yeah, it was super short, but there's not a lot of stuff to show. And I will try to make this a week long re uh, vlog of some sort. It's gonna be my first time so i'm nervous but also looking forward to seeing how it'll turn out but yeah thanks for watching let me know if you're gonna join the creative thought or not and yeah i will see you in the rest of the vlog <laughs>